everyone welcome back to my channel so today I thought it would be um, a good idea to do some skincare with you I've got a few things to try I've got some micro needling facial rollers that are new I've also got some new serums and masks to try out and also I'm going to be doing some microdermabrasion in this video as well don't forget to like comment and subscribe below and let's get into the video Honestly, just thought we could just have a bit of a chit chat, um, grab a cup of tea, grab some snacks and also have a bit of a pamper session as well. We'll be doing my skincare, just going into a really luxurious deep skincare routine with you all. So first thing that I'm going to be taking is the Aspar Optimal Skin Pro Cleanser. This is a 3-in-1 cleanser. Um, a cleanser, an exfoliator and a mask. It has moringa seed extract uh, to cleanse and remove makeup while jojoba spheres gently exfoliates and melts away to leave the skin clear and smooth. It also has pumpkin enzymes in there to get rid of any dull skin cells. So I'm just going to pop a little bit of that on my hands. I'm just going to buff into my skin. This can literally be used on dry skin or you can add some water with it, it really doesn't matter. Once you've rubbed all the um, jojoba spheres into the skin and it's left with like a really, with like a really dewy cream on the skin, that is your mask, that is when your mask is ex activated and you can literally just leave that on for 15 minutes if you wanted to use it as a mask as well. Get to go down your neck area. I'm just going to move on to the microdermabrasion. So, this is what it looks like it comes with a cord, and then you just plug it in. It comes with a few different heads. So, this is the diamond head that I've got on it now. It comes with one that is literally just round, and then it comes with one that's pointy, like that. The that I'm going to be using today is just the diamond head, and I'm just going to really exfoliate my skin just because I feel like it does need a deep cleanse. You just turn the timer to whatever you want it to be. I usually set mine right up to 30 minutes. I don't use it for that long. Um, and then you have one, two, and three levels. One is just a gentle exfoliation, two is also uh, just a medium exfoliation and three is a really deep exfoliation. I like to put it on three so my skin does look really red afterwards but that's completely normal. Make sure you keep the skin really taut because stretching the skin out then you get a smooth glide with the microdermabrasion machine you need the smooth glide because if you end up having it on an area too long um, you can end up giving yourself a bit of a hickey mark you can see where I've gone over some areas with the machine and it's just made me a little bit red. But what is everyone up to? Um, our, we've just found out with the coronavirus we are over our peak of the virus now so hopefully things will be returning to normal shortly. Is everyone working still? I'm just going to turn the setting down back to one. I'm just going to um, go around like my nose area, my chin, anywhere that I get blackheads and just um, try get any of them out really good for sucking out any dirt or bacteria that you might have in the pores as well so now that we have done that i'm going to put a mask on this is the mask that i'm going to be using this is um something that i've never used before it's by the brand demovio but it's a vitamin E woven face mask. It's to help moisturise and hydrate your skin, increasing the natural 
exfoliation rate and improves your skin texture enriched with a special combination of herbal extracts that continue and nourish the skin so it has got vitamin e in it and it says to leave it on for 15 to 20 minutes so i'm just going to leave it on for the full 20 minutes straight off the bat it smells a bit like play-doh so it comes on a little sheet feels really nice and cooling. Oh, I quite like the feel of that actually on my skin. And whatever excess there is, I'm just gonna rub that down my neck. I have this face mask on, I'm just gonna use this rose quart roller. Um, these are really good if you keep them in the fridge or if you just put them in the freezer for like five, 10 minutes, just before you're gonna use it. And then you just use it to roll onto the skin, which is really soothing for the skin. So I'm just gonna use this to really help that product absorb into my skin so that I literally get the full potential from the product. So if you have anything like the rose quartz um, rollers or jade stones, anything like that, are really good for helping to soothe the skin. So is there any like particular videos that you are wanting to watch? Um, I have got like a few ideas in mind. I want to see more pamper stuff or I mean I can do my baby videos it's entirely up to you guys what you're fancying as well get to um, follow me all on my social medias as well just so you can keep up to date with me on there because I do like to post a lot especially on my Instagram and my snapchat while wait for this one let's have a bit of a catch up oh my god I look so funny there's this um product that's an LED rejuvenating light that um, I am wanting to buy. Uh, would you guys want to see a review on that or is it for a week or two and see how it actually affects my skin? Like treatment on the skin, if you've heard of anything like that then it's um, similar to that. And each colour has a different uh, use for it, so like red is for wrinkles, blue is for acne prone skin or oily skin. I am back, it's been 20 minutes, I'm just going to take this off and the packet to just massage any excess product into the skin, which my skin is literally drinking it up, it really needs some hydration. I've never used it before, so I'm scared because this is needles going into my skin. Actually trained in this so I do know how to use them. They all come in little sterilised packets as well because with obviously needles you do need to keep it all sterilised. So the large roller is usually used on the body area so legs, hips, medium roller, which is already on the tool now is used for cheeks forehead and neck and then the small roller is used for around the lips and eyes it actually doesn't feel that bad apply a bit of serum so obviously i have got the serum on still from the mask so i'm going to use that to alongside this just apply a really light to medium pressure you don't want to be obviously stabbing yourself or causing any sort of abrasions or any cuts microneedling it's really good for helping to reduce any acne um or acne scars obviously you can't use it on open acne but you can use it when your acne is starting to heal up and as well you will find that your skin does go red. That is obviously normal because you are penetrating your skin with loads of little needles. I'm now gonna apply this vitamin C serum. I've never used it before. Brightening serum, glow and radiant. Brightening complexion, skin appears more even. Oh, it smells really nice. Mmm, that smells lovely. It doesn't feel like any other serum that I've used before. It's immediately soaked into my skin. It feels really hydrating, 
my skin feels nice and soft as well. I'm definitely gonna keep this in my skincare because this feels really nice. I'll take the rose quartz roller again. I've just took it out of the freezer so it's really nice and cool just to soothe any of that redness from the micro needling. Eye cream, um, I used this in my last video, my last pamper video. If you want to watch that, then I can leave the link for it in the description. If people also be interested in another nail video, I can show you how to do um, a marble effect on your nails and add in some um, foil to your nails. The 24 hour replenishing moisturizer by the brand Aspa. Carmex on my lips. Um, I've used this for literal years and I swear by it still. It's the only thing that really makes my lips nice and soft. So this is my skin afterwards. Obviously, as you can see, I am still a little bit red in places, but that will just calm down after a few hours. Obviously, I have done microdermabrasion and microneedling on it, but my skin feels nice and soft, hydrated, really refreshed. Thank you everyone for watching my skincare video. If you like seeing videos like this, just hit the like button and also subscribe down below and I will see you in the next video. Bye!